It is the 9th of the 5th, 2012. This is today's climate change update. Let's go ahead and get started on SOT.net tonight. Japan tornado temperature difference spawned supercell storm. The deadly tornado that hit a residential area on Sunday is believed to have been triggered by temperature difference of more than 40 degrees Celsius between high altitude cold air mass and a warm moist air near the ground, which developed a cumulus cloud and rotating ascending air current. Uh, so basically, a Midwest style superstorm, really small compact supercell uh, cause of all that damage that was in Japan. Britain to see months worth of rain in one night as severe weather warnings issued. Severe weather warnings were issued last night for large swaths of Britain as more torrential downpours are on their way. So heads up. Civil Defense in, in, of Peru issues earthquake warnings after two days of abnormal tremor activity. The Civil Defense of Peru intensified, uh, intensified today a prevention dr drive warning of a potential massive earthquake now predicted of two daily tremor average. Uh, they called on every workplace and home to be ready for an emergency evacuation plan after a median quake and two replicas were recorded Sunday uh, in Inca and in Lima. Scotland colder than the Arctic as country hit by snow and freezing weather. Scotland was colder than one of the Ar than the Arctic at the weekend with freezing temperatures and snow. Uh, it was negative 7.4 degrees Celsius on Saturday morning. And uh, Carningorm Mountain near in Ashar. Huge dust storm swallows Iowa College campus. They got a, a pretty dramatic video of a big wall cloud coming through and it's kicking up all the dust and the dirt off the the corn fields or the, the farm fields that are here in Iowa and it rolls these big dust clouds, these big dust storms through. If you've never seen one, it's kind of like a, a sandstorm. And fears increase of big earthquake near Tokyo in foreseeable future. A prominent Japanese seismologist rattled some nerves when he declared that there was a 70% chance of a major earthquake in or around Tokyo in the next four years. And isn't that the time frame to shore up number four uh, fuel pools? Over to the extinction protocol. Tornado and hail moved through Oxen Oxfordshire, United Kingdom. Uh, they got a photograph of it and some uh, video. Britain could be braced for more thunder and lightning following a storm which brought a tornado to Oxfordshire. The, stun the, thunder the thunderstorm started in Wiltshire and moved across uh, where the tornado was reported in several places. Four killed, ten missing in Indonesian floods. Floods carrying volcanic debris swept through a town in eastern Indonesia Wednesday, killing four people, including a nine-year-old child, and leaving ten others missing. Two inbound CMEs could spark moder moderate geomagnetic storms. That's the pretty, pretty lights, the Aurora Borealis. I believe we've had two M pop off. Boom, boom. And then that's that new big sunspot, uh, 1476, coming around the corner. And where was the other story? Flooding and drought. Brazil uh, lacerated by opposing climate extremes. While the swath of Brazilian Amazon is under a state of emergency with one of the worst floods ever, the country's northeastern region is suffering through the worst drought in the last 30 years. And that's about all new they have going on tonight. Uh, over to the nuclear stuff. Uh, any news? Gunderson book number one on Japan's science bestseller list. Long interview with Mayor of Tokyo TV station up and coming. Uranium detected in soil, Tokyo soil sample, quote, that needs more study, says nuclear expert. Asia Pacific Journal's reporting sur surging suicide rate among Fukushima evacuees. 
quote, figures have been fabricated to save face. Officials press hard for cover-ups. Joe Rogan on uh, number four fuel pool at Fukushima. Nuclear power is like summoning a, summoning a demon. It's ridiculous. And I agree with him. And uh, top talk show discusses Professor Koide's statement about feeding Fukushima contaminated food to supporters of nuclear power. Uh, if they're declaring that it's all safe, they should eat big plates of it. Uh, rumors of stressed out Fukushima nuclear workers attacking women. And um, effects of plutonium on lung tissue. See single per particle causes fibro fibrotic nodule in lung. Eases fears in West Coast. And I watched the video. Uh, I believe this is the one where he was sitting talking with Arnie Gunderson. Discussing hot particles um, and the air filters that they tested back in April of last year. Um, he stressed that normal background radiation is not safe, uh, a.k.a. Um, and people trying to say, hey, this is nothing more than a couple um, background radiation thing, um, just adds to what is already a public health issue uh, here globally due to all the nuclear um, goings on over the last 40, 50 years, 60 years. When the earthquake occurred, the reactor sunk about a meter into the earth. And that's why these things are gone China syndrome and they don't know where the water's going. And that's about all I'm going to cover there tonight. One last story tonight. It's off of. Uh, Fukushima Diary, power company, quote, even if we have enough power, we need to restart nuclear power plants. Uh, an energy strategy meeting, Kansai Electric Power Company, or KEPCO, commented whether power in, is in oversupply or in shortage. They want to restart the nuclear plants. It has nothing to do with the power supply to restart the nuclear plants. And these are the OI, OOI nuclear power plants. In case this summer is as hot as 2010, Japan will be short of power by 0.4%. 0.4. However, it is estimated that over three power companies can support KEPCO. Power generation with pumped up water should be added even more power supply. The reason why KEPCO and other power companies try to stick to nuclear power is because almost half of their property is related to nuclear. Nuclear is only needed to keep power companies rich. It has nothing to do with the actual power supply. It has nothing to do with the actual power supply. Nuclear energy is a crime against humanity and all these people should be pressed charges on. Enjoy what you can everybody. Thanks.